to Flemington, home of the Emirates Melbourne Cup Carnival. I'm Sarah Peatling and tonight at the lovely Sofitel Hotel, we welcome home the Emirates Melbourne Cup. Ladies and gentlemen, the winner of Miss Universe Australia and the recent top 10 finals of the Miss Universe World Pageant held in Brazil in September, please welcome Cherie Lee Biggs. And it's been wonderful. We've taken it around the world. We've been to North America, to Los Angeles, to New York, to Boston. We've been to Asia, to Japan, and to Hong Kong, to Shanghai, and to Singapore, Dubai, to London, and to du Dublin, and, uh, and other places. So it has been a, an absolute um, privilege to be able to put the Emirates Melbourne Cup on the world map in that respect. It will be my first time at Melbourne Cup. Um, I'm looking forward to it. I'm, I'm new to the whole race scene because I've just moved to Melbourne. I'm a Perth girl. But um, I'm learning really fast and I think I'll really enjoy this, this season. <laughs> now, you are a fashionable young lady. What sort of tips do you have for uh, our race goers out there this year from a fashion perspective? Um, I don't know. I think really just go with your own style there. It's, it's a... It's a nice time to kind of run with your own sorts of styles and play with it because, you know, it's a, it's a very playful kind of fashion. Um, I think make the best of these beautiful spring colour blocking, you know, styles that we've got coming in. I know I'm having lots of fun with the bright colours. Another part of tonight's feature event is a photographic display put together by James Gear, which really symbolises the future of racing and its upcoming stars. It's traditionally the imagery is um, very structured and very safe and what we've tried to do with this exhibition is break a few boundaries and um, have a bit of fun. What I really wanted to express through my images was the hard work that goes into horse racing you know so uh, Michelle happened to be particularly pretty which was great she had amazing eyes and I I knew what she looked like, I wanted to bring attention to her eyes, but I also wanted to bring attention to the fact that it's not all glamour, it's not all fashion, a lot of hard work goes into this business. I think special thanks goes to James Gear, the photographer, he really got me in the mood. Uh, it took us about 45 minutes to do it, um, we constructed a lot of the uh, atmosphere that, that you see there, uh, did it beneath the grandstand at Randwick and uh, it was actually a bit of fun. The barrier trials at Randwick had just finished so I got a lot of hecklers walking past as they were taking the shot. It was uh, more than a little bit embarrassing. The countdown is on now with just over one week to go until the Emirates Melbourne Cup. Contact Ticketmaster now to witness the race that stops a nation.